Hello all. In this video, we are going to study how a Boolean expression can be realized using 8051 microcontroller. So the given Boolean expression here is y is equal to this expression which is consisting of three Boolean variables a, b, c. So let us learn how to realize this using 8051 microcontroller. So before going directly writing to the program, let us analyze what are the variables and how to assign these variables to different memory locations. So we are seeing in the diagram the internal structure of the RAM in 8051 microcontroller. As we all know, from 0, 0 to 1FH there are register banks. From 20H to 2FH, this is 16 bytes of bit addressable area. What does it mean? Each and every byte has 8 bits. Each and every bit in these memory locations has bit address. So, in our program, we want to use this because A, B, C are the Boolean variables which will take a binary value either 0 or a 1. So, it's a bit. So, we have to consider these bit addresses and we are trying to realize that particular expression. So, in our uh, expression, so we are taking 0, 0, 0, 1 and 0, 2 only because there are three variables A, B, C. So, let us try to assign this 0, 0 as A. 0, 1 as B, 0, 2 as C. So, we have considered three bit memory locations in the RAM that is 0, 0, 0, 1 and 0, 2. Kindly note, this 0, 0, 0, 1, 0, 2 are the bit addresses present in the memory location 20H. It is not this 0, 0, 0, 1. Because we are dealing here with the binary variables A, B, C which are Boolean variables which take a bit value. Hence, we are considering this bit addresses 0, 0, 0, 1, 0, 2. So, whatever I have written here is this bit address. So, we will not be assigning directly or there is no instruction to assign this a boolean variable to this memory location rather we have to understand as a programmer or a user wherever i use 00, 0 it means it's a wherever i use 0, 01 it means it's b wherever it, i use 0, 02 it means it's c so these are the boolean variables which we have assigned to this addresses so from now onwards while writing the program i'll be using this addresses if i'm using 00, 0 it means it's a 0, 02 it means it's c so, whenever we have to realize this Boolean expression or to verify this Boolean expression, obviously I have to take the value of A as 0 or 1, B as 0 or 1, C as 0 or 1, like this. So, let us consider, I have uh, verifying this Boolean expression, A is equal to 1, B is equal to 0, C is equal to 1. Not mandatory you have to consider this itself. Any other values also you can consider and you can verify the Boolean expression. To uh, explain an example, we have considered like this. So, what I am doing? A is equal to 1, B is equal to 0, C is equal to 1. Let us start writing the program. As usual, the first instruction is ORG00H. As we have considered, a is equal to 1, B is equal to 0, C is equal to 1. We are trying to assign the same through the expressions, through the instructions now. Set B, 0, 0, H. What we are doing here? We are considering A is equal to 1. Clear 0, 1, H. What we are doing here? B is equal to 0. Set B, 0, 2, H. What we are doing here? C is equal to 1. So, values we have assigned to those memory locations. What we have to do now is to realize this Boolean expression. So, first let us try to realize this particular term. As we are observing here, we have to, in order to realize this term, we have to do AND operation and OR operation. In order to perform this, the instructions available is ANL and ORL in the 8051 assembly language. For which C is the compulsory bit to be used. So, either as a source or a destination C that is a carry flag which is there in the PSW register should be compulsorily used. So, what shall we do now in order to realize this particular term that is A, B bar C one of the variable we shall try to move it into C and then we shall proceed further. So, let us move A the value of uh, which we have assigned the value 1 we shall move it into C. So, what instruction I have to write for this? Move 
C, comma, 0, 0, H. So, what I am doing here, the value of A, I am copying it into C. Now, what I have to do, I have to and it with B bar, right? So, A into B bar, I have to do. So, A is in C. So, in order to do the and operation, I have the instruction A and L. So, C, comma, where is my B? It is in 0, 1, H, right? So, I will write 0, 1, H. H. So, what I will get here, I am getting A, B, that is it. But what I want is A, B bar. So, we have an optional instruction here that we can write a slash. So, A, B bar is implemented. So, now I have to implement again A, B bar, C for which the answer of this which is there in the carry bit, I have to and it again with 0, 2H, A, N, L, 0, 2h correct no so what we have done now a we had b bar we had the result of this was there in the carry bit so now we have ending it with c so my expression the term a b bar c is implemented and the answer of the same is there in carry bit now if i have to implement the other expression this i want the carry bit again but i have stored the result of this in the carry bit so let us move this in some memory location as i have used 0, 0, 0, 1, 0, 2 bit addresses i'll use the next bit address now that is 0, 3 h so 0, 3 h is being copied with the value present in the carry so this is having this expression the result of this expression a b bar c so in order to implement the next term a bar b c what we have done is we have moved 0 1 that is b to c i am adding the same with 0 2 so what we are doing here b into c is realized but what we want is a bar b c b c is already realized and the answer of the same is in c so i am adding the same with c comma slash backslash 00 h so which is nothing but a bar so a bar b c is realized the answer of this term is in the carry bit but i want the carry bit for my next operation so let us move the same in other memory location as i have already used 0 3 let me use 0 4 h comma c so the second term ka result is there in the memory location 0 4 h now i have to realize this expression a b bar a b c bar for which we are doing copying a into c which is nothing but 0 0 then we are adding the same with 0 1 so what we have got here a or ended with b now a n l c comma slash 0 2 which is nothing but a b which was there in c now c bar so a b c bar is realized and the answer of the same is there in the carry bit what we have to do now is provide this or operation and it is already been done i have to do this or so the result of this is there in the memory location 0 3 h the result of this is there in the memory location 0 4 h the result of this is there in the carry bit so do remember the 0 3 0 4 are bit addresses so the answer is in c i am oring it with 0 4 where we have stored one term ka answer another term answer is in 0 3 i am adding doing the or operation using the instruction orl so with this instruction we are having the answer in Z c that is carry bit i am trying to copy the same into 0 8h so the final answer of all this term is there in 0 8h where will we check this 0 8h do remember see this is a bit address so 0 8h is in the memory location 21 i cannot individually see this individual 0 8h so what we have to do while checking the results we have to verify the memory location 21h the only bit lower significant bit will show the answer that is 0 8h will be having the answer in order to verify this we have to check the memory location 21h so what will be the answer if i uh, apply those variables with the respective values c a is assigned with 1 b is assigned with 0 c is assigned with 1 so let us apply these values and verify the results with this the values are applied value of this is 1 plus the value of this is 0 the value of this will be 0 so 1 odd with 0 odd with 0 will be 1 
So the final answer will be 1. Where we have to check this? It will be there in the memory location 08H. But this 08 we cannot see individually. So this 08 can be observed in the RAM location 21H. As for this expression, the value is result is 1. After executing this program, 21H should contain the value 01H. And here is the whole program for realizing the Boolean expression y is equal to the Boolean expression with three variables. Hope you understood the concept and the program. Thank you.